Well, thousands of people are back in Omaha for Berkshire Hathaway's annual shareholders meeting this weekend. Yeah, and you're probably going to start noticing crowds downtown. Some of them are already sightseeing. KTV News Watch 7's Alex McLoon found folks in Dundee and at the airport today. Today is the day Epley Airfield expects thousands of Berkshire Hathaway shareholders and meeting attendees to start arriving in Omaha. And some early arrivals are already out and about checking out Warren Buffett's home in Dundee. I mean, if your name's Warren Buffett and that's your home, it's kind of humble, right? Yeah, it's it's amazing, really. I mean, to to see where you can walk right up to it. Some came from as far away as Luxembourg and Sweden. Peter Westberg and his friends are back for a second year after starting the investing app called Quarter. And we are growing in the U.S. as well, so this is our biggest market. So we hope to sign some deals here in Omaha to co convert some, some of the other nerds. We work with Amazon in Luxembourg, yeah. so Luxembourg is European headquarters for Amazon. There's always a difference between watching it on screen, watching it on YouTube, and then being in person, you really feel the energy of the stuff. Some of those shareholders say they're going to be checking out places like the zoo, Garot Steakhouse, places like South Omaha and the Blackstone District until things really kick off this weekend. So crowds are on the way. At Epley Airfield, Alex McLoon, KETV Newswatch 7. They are indeed, and with Omaha packed with shareholders, there are several events for them to check out. Friday kicks off the official shareholders shopping day at the CHI Health Center. That continues at Borsheim's at Regency from 6 to 8 p.m. Saturday, Warren Buffett begins answering questions at 9.15 a.m. The meeting begins at 4.30 with the Nebraska Furniture Mart picnic starting at 5.30. And then Sunday, it's the Invest in Yourself 5K, followed by more shopping at Borsheim's from 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. And as Alex mentioned, visitors are coming here from all around the world, and that means a local boost for the economy. You know, when a visitor comes to town, they, they usually get a hotel. That means the hotel is full. Um, they they don't have a kitchen, right? So they have to go out to eat for most of their, um, their meals. Um, they have to get somewhere. A lot of times people don't... Um, you know, drive in, they'll fly in, they've got to rent a car or or take some type of transportation. It's really an when we have out of town visitors in, it's really an influx of cash for our city and for our businesses.